I just finished uh, my first block of the second second row, uh, second seam of quilting slash decorative stitching. And that's the pattern I, sh I chose. And I'm using, obviously, the white thread. Um, this one takes a little bit longer to do because it's a little more intricate. There's more stitching. It's a pretty cool stitch, though. And you can see it on the black. You don't even see it that much on the back. It's kind of hard to see the design because of the white. I thought it would show up a little bit better than that, but that's okay. Oh, one down, 11 more to go. So, there we go. Second okay, row. Okay, this is not without its problems. I just started my second block and it got stuck. As you can see, I've got a big water thread right there. It was getting stuck here. I picked up the needle, started doing it again, and it got stuck. So that's a real drag. Um, the plus to that is you can't, is matching the pattern. Um, it doesn't even look like it was doing it correctly even at the beginning. So, I'm going to be a little while trying to get that out. <laughs> oh, fun. So, it's not always smooth and easy. Unfortunately, first seam went really well. But, the more complicated ones and going over those seams is a little challenging. So, sure, I'll be back later. I think I'm going to uh, change the stitch. I've only got one done with that, and it, it went through okay. This one did not. Um, I was looking at the first one that I did, which is in here, and looking at, because I've got it flipped over, <laughs> at the different stitches that I used, and I did not use that on this quilt at all. So... I think I will try a different stitch, um, hopefully with better results. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, I can't afford to have this catching the way this did on these seams. Um, I've got most of the thread off of the back in there. I'm not going to be able to get that out. Um, it's too many stitches, and I don't want to be um, tearing my block or my backing. So this block is going to be far from perfect. I'm going to start a new stitch, hopefully at that seam, and go down this way. So that's my plan. <laughs> My quilts are not perfect, that's for darn sure. Okay, I changed my stitch to that one. And I started at this end because it's easier to go over the sewn seam than it is to go over this one. But it went over that one okay. So I'm gonna keep going with that one and see if I can get that to work.